What's up guys? This is Salt Pros again uh, with a video. Then uh, there is a problem that I had when I was replacing the LCD on this uh, Galaxy S8. As you guys can see, I already have it open it right here. And I want to share this uh, with you guys because this might help you. Uh, to solve this problem that I had. I went through the forums on the internet looking for the problem but uh, they didn't give me any viable solution without me exchanging any part or, or doing soldering. But <clears throat> as you guys can see I opened the phone and I, I, I was going to go and change uh, the LCD as you guys can see over here but when I change the LCD I want to test it before I install it which is uh, what we do so w when I when I go ahead and test the phone I put it to charge actually the phone was dead so I put it to charge as you guys can see uh, I just wait a couple of minutes and the phone give me this sign give me the, the sign like uh, there is a problem with temperature of the battery so I'm gonna go ahead and turn on turn on the phone so you guys can see um, there you go so you guys can see uh, what I'm talking about let's give it a few minutes a few seconds there you go <clears throat> I'm gonna plug this cable so you guys can see what the phone does wh when I connect it and of course uh, the phone was working uh, perfectly fine uh, before I open it so th that was my concern because uh, I didn't do anything wrong I wanna increase the brightness right here so Okay, this phone has so many warnings. Do this, do that. Anyways, um, as you guys can see, I'm gonna plug in the phone, and boom! Right away, it gives me uh, it's in Spanish, but right there it says like the battery temperature is too low. The charge in is being pulsed. So. I was oh my god did I break something but uh, I didn't do anything wrong uh, the phone is not being overheat or something but in this case it's not even saying the battery is is too hot or the device is too hot which is the message then we usually get this is uh, it's just saying the battery temperature is too low which is I, I even went with the blow, with the blower and like trying to heat the battery a little bit to see if that worked, but nothing it worked. And I just I was I was so shut, and I was thinking to myself, what I do now? What I do now? Because this this message keep keep popping. Look, I do it again so you guys can see. I'm not, I'm, I'm not playing. You see, and also you can see the battery right there blinking. I'm gonna bring it a little closer. You see, it's not the regular charge symbol. It's just blinking. It's like when you try to charge phone without battery. So, the solution I want to share with you guys uh, it was very very simple, very very simple. I mean, if you would have put the phone together. Uh, without testing the screen and having the phone taken apart like this maybe you wouldn't even have this problem but look uh, I'm gonna just go ahead uh, turn off the phone I'm gonna unplug the battery and I'm gonna connect I'm gonna plug the battery back in place put it back in place and this is the wireless charger when I went and put the wireless charger 
don't worry about those cables um, this is just the test I'm not putting the phone back together okay I secure that and I'm gonna go and turn the phone oh actually I'm actually I'm gonna test it like this I'm gonna just plug it in And right there guys boom the phone is charging after I after I install the wireless charger the phone is working perfect so this brings me to a conclusion that would the phone work with would any any galaxy work without the wireless charger uh, system uh, that's that's kind of tricky guys because you know the, who uses the wireless charger like maybe 50% of the people not 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 everybody uses the wireless charger but let's just say that just in case this goes missing or something goes wrong in a repair and let's us or I mean you can always get it but the thing is would this phone work without the wireless charger I mean, in this case, it's obviously uh, the phone didn't work without this. So, basically, that's the solution for that problem, guys. I mean, I, I see a lot of things over there on the internet. Um, so, many other phones giving problems like this. Possible, uh, this, something is wrong with this. Um, the wireless charger system uh, so maybe if you try to replace it and um, it, it will solve that same problem the the battery not being uh, the phone not able to read the real temperature of the battery or the phone not working properly as you guys can see now I don't know why this brightness keep going down okay no problem look at that now it's charging normal so I hope you got this is uh, this help for some people out there then I know when we're doing a repair we crossed these problems and sometimes we get stuck so just share this video if it's helpful for you and you think will help somebody else okay this is cell pros repair um, alright guys see you in the next video when I find something something like this problem any solution then I wanna share with you guys I will post it over here so you guys can can share it and use the content okay guys thank you see you next time